Hi everyone, so today is a really exciting video. I am doing a Studio Ghibli collab with my friend Sarah from Funky Pink Gal. So as you can see from this, I'm making a no face necklace with a little stack of gold nuggets and then she's making this Kiki's Delivery Chibi. So click on the screen now to go and see her tutorial. But if you want to stick around to see mine, then keep watching. So all you want to do is start with a round ball of black clay and all you want to do is then roll that into a thick log. After you've done that, all you want to do is press it down into a rounded rectangle shape. So this is going to be the body of no face. Now I'm just getting my fingerprints off because my black clay is very soft. Just rub the top of the clay. You can also use rubbing alcohol or nail varnish remover and just put that on the surface and that should get rid of your fingerprints as well. So once you've done that, all you want to do is add an eye pin. I am using gold findings, which I think looks really good with the black and the white. So next to make his face all you want to do is take some white clay and all I did was just flatten it out between my fingers into another rounded rectangle shape that is smaller than the one we made out of black clay. Now all you want to do is just flatten that on so it's nice and secure. Put that to one side and we will bake that in a second. Now to make the stack of gold nuggets, I'm literally just taking very small balls of gold clay. I'm using Antique Gold by Sculpey. And all you want to do is just keep stacking those up until you get a stack that you like or the size that you like. I'm doing mine in a triangle shape, you can do it in a circle shape, it doesn't, maybe it doesn't have to be 3D. It's completely up to you but I'm just making it in a triangle shape. So all you want to do is just keep adding the balls until you get the height and the shape that you want. So after you've done that I'm just taking a dotting tool and I'm adding some slight texture because in the film Spirited Away, which is where No Face is from, he, get, he hands out gold nuggets and they look a bit more like gold coins before they're textured. So, But this is completely optional if you want to do this or not. Add an eye pin to that also and again I'm using gold to match everything. So now what you want to do is bake the No Face charm and this pile of gold nuggets. So once you bake them it should look like this. I also gave you a little example of like a more chibi style so it looks more like a Russian doll rather than a straight rectangle. So I'm just showing you different ways of doing it. I am going to paint both for you so you can see different styles. So all you want to do is take a reference from Google. I will leave my favourites in the description box for you so you can check those out. And all I'm doing is just roughly marking it out with a pencil. So now what you need to do is take a dotting tool and I've dipped it in black acrylic paint, you can use whatever you have at home, and all you want to do is then just fill in the design of the face with acrylic paint. I'm also going to be using lavender paint because some pictures show it with a lavender colour and some just black and grey, but it's completely up to you. Now this may take a bit of patience because I know not everyone is good at painting, I'm far from good at painting, but just be very patient and have a very steady hand and you'll get there. So this is what they look like. I did a sort of chibi version on the right and then a more realistic version on the left. So once you've painted your no face, all I then did was glaze both of my pieces and attach it to a necklace. So I hope you've enjoyed this tutorial and don't forget to check out Funky Pink Gal's tutorial on this Kiki Chibi. It's so, so, so cute. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. Don't forget to check out my last video, which is on the screen now. You can click on it. And don't forget to check out my Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and my shop. So thank you guys for watching, and I really hope you enjoyed this. Bye!